Hello and welcome to this quick tips video which is about the second use of the alt key, option key on the Mac. So this is about arrays. So last time we cut things up, this time it's about using arrays. So to make things a bit clearer, I'm just going to color code this part in red so you see what's happening. Now with the arrays tool, obviously you can just click on things willy-nilly to delete them. But if you hold down the alt key and click on a part, everything after that gets deleted. So you'll see everything on this finger base track will get deleted, but not the red one that I'm actually going to click on. So that's slightly unusual, but this can be really useful when you've got particularly sort of dance music kind of arrangements where you've got lots of parts which have been repeated and maybe you want to just remove them from the rest of the track. I often end up with a graveyard of parts towards the right, which I eventually decide I don't want to use anymore. So it's, it's useful for getting rid of things like that to make sure there's nothing extraneous hanging around in your arrangement. So as ever, hope you found that useful and we'll see you again soon for more music tech tuition.